there, it's Annie Lou. How are you? Look at what I have. Art Snacks. I received an email yesterday and it said my Art Snacks box was on the way. And that was Friday. Today's Saturday. It's here. God bless the United States of America postal system. Love it. Let's open it up and see what's here. So, I have a card and a gumball. Wish I could have a gumball, but just not going to happen. Okay, so here's a little description um, bookmark thing. So let's get right in here and open this up. Don't know what's in it. Oh. Oh, oh. Okay. So the Art Snacks sticker. I have to gather all my stickers. All right, so the first thing I have in here is a sketch and wash pencil by Generals. So this is a water-soluble pencil, and it's a soft black graphite. Draw directly on wet paper to darken lines and details. So, this is a piece of watercolor paper. So, let's see. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. So I have just this um, brush and I am sure this is going, oh it doesn't really blend. I'm a little surprised. Very, 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 very little movement. Ever so slight. Let's get some wet. This is really good for shading because you could like do an eye or something. And then get that brush and yeah, it moves a little bit, ever so little. Great. What happens if we wet it? Oh yeah, now it moves. All right, so we'll come up with something to use that. Now the next thing we have is a Pigma pen, a number one. Alright, so the number one, it has a nice bullet on it. It's nice and, and hard. I like that in a pen. Now is this waterproof? Let's see. It moves. Sometimes if you give these pens a little bit of time to um, set or maybe get your heat gun, it'll make it permanent, but not right now. Ooh, this is a nice brush. So this is a Princeton Aqua Elite Series 4850 Synthetic Kolinsky Sable Brush. That is a mouthful. It has a wonderful point on it. Aqua Elite. Feels nice. Looks wonderful. Now, another thing that we got are watercolors. We have Daniel Smith Extra Fine Watercolors. And I have two little tubes here. They gave me two colors. Whoops. So this one is called Messy. Okay, so that one is a rose. I can't, yeah, I can see it. I just don't know how to pronounce it. Q-U-I-N-A-C-I-D-O-N-E rose. It's a pretty red, so I'm going to take this great new paintbrush. So I loaded my paintbrush up with water. Just pat it out a little bit. Just pick up a little bit of the paint 
Oh, what a beautiful color. Just beautiful. So that's on dry paper. Oh, it's just magnificent. This would be a really pretty um, lipstick color. Yes, it would. Okay. And then the next color that I received is a yellow. Hansa Yellow Light. So there we go. Now the good thing about yellow and red is I think I'll be able to get a third color. Let's do the yellow first. Once again it's on dry paper. Very, very pretty. So pretty. Okay. Now let's see when we do dark into light. Dark into light. Isn't that right? Yes, it is. So I'll pick up a little bit of red, a little bit of the yellow. Hmm. I'm getting a third color, but maybe like an orangey color. I like it. Okay. Yeah. Great, great three colors here. Three colors out of two. How great is America? And I think that's it. So I shall go along and create something. And the brush is what they call a staff favorite. So I'd like to share something with you. So I do like to protect my my brushes. Um, this is sort of like this mesh thing. I actually got it in a Fab Fit Fun box. And it's actually to protect your makeup brushes. But when I saw it, I said, oh my word. Look at that. It protects my... Um, my brush. Well, thank you for joining me. I am going to create something and I will come back with a video that um, has something made from these products. So you take care. Bye-bye. Mm,